got yourself an Android phone? I do. I have the AT&T Backflip. Not the coolest Android phone out there. Not gonna lie. But, the one thing that I do like about the Android is a little application called Advanced Task Killer. It's that little, little green guy right there. What you do is you hit it, and it tells you how many tasks were killed. And you can customize it. They have a, a free one, and they have one that I believe is $4.99. Uh, now, the free one does a damn good job. It does is, um, specifically with the Motorola, you have what's called Motorola Blur. And it pulls all your information from uh, whatever sites you have. Like right now I have Facebook and my email. I used to have Twitter, but that would drain down the battery like nobody's business. It was annoying. So I got rid of Twitter. Uh, now I just have Facebook. And my battery lasts uh, a little bit longer. And since I've been more proactive about using advanced task killer every time I uh, look at my phone I'm like oh I wonder how many tasks are running I go and hit the little widget and it kills all the tasks and bring you right back to the home screen now the only drawback is um, once you hit it it'll take a couple seconds for the touch screen to respond again as far as if, if you hit it and you're like oh, I gotta go home you know it's not going to respond right away, especially if you do it in the actual program. Um, but if you have it in the widget, it is a little bit faster. So that's one of the one of the drawbacks. Um, plus, I don't know if the applications are really using you know as much memory as they say they are, and if it's really cleared up as much mem memory as it uh, it says it does. But Advanced Task Killer is free in the Android market and it is an application that I recommend everybody who has an Android phone to have uh, saves your battery life it's really good get it I don't know why I did that